Google started switching their phones to USB-C in 2015, with Samsung following suit in 2016. So why did it take Apple until 2023 to switch the iPhone to USB-C? Well, one reason is that USB-C came out one year after Apple transitioned to Lightning from the 30-pin iPod connector, which had been around for a decade. And this timing was an issue, since switching to Lightning had already earned Apple a considerable amount of backlash, with users complaining that Apple was just trying to sell more accessories and chargers by switching to a new connector. Also, using their own proprietary connector meant collecting a licensing fee when third-party companies used it in their products. So switching from Lightning to USB-C would not only mean angry customers who had just thrown away their 30-pin connectors for Lightning and would have to do it all over again for USB-C, but also losing a revenue source from Lightning's licensing fees. So Apple had little incentive to switch iPhone to USB-C. That was until the European Union stepped in. They voted to pass legislation that would force a standard connector across all mobile phones, tablets, cameras, and headphones. That way, customers wouldn't have to buy different chargers with each new device. Plus, only needing one charger would mean reducing electronic waste. The standard connector the EU chose was USB-C, and they were forcing all manufacturers to switch by fall 2024. So back in fall 2022, Apple publicly admitted they'd have no choice but to comply with the legislation, igniting speculation whether the switch would be made with the iPhone 15 in 2023 or 16 in 2024. Well, now we have our answer, with Apple finally moving from Lightning to USB-C on both the iPhone 15 and 15 Pro models. And while many people are excited to simplify their cable collection, others are frustrated that their old accessories and chargers have essentially been rendered useless. So that's why Apple switched to USB-C. This is Greg with Apple Explained. Thanks for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next video.